This is for a quick video of anybody who decides to go ahead and put the Trail Armor skid plate and the Mud Busters extended flares on your R-Max 1000. If you notice, I've already cut it off, but what happens is it sticks out about that far. And I was getting ready to go to Half Hill McCoy's. Now, I'm not so much worried about the front because the wheel is pretty much there. But if I was to slide across rocks and stuff, my biggest problem is how much pressure this is going to turn around after a while and just stress the hell out of it and worry about all the fasteners in there and popping it out. So what I ended up doing is going ahead and cutting this straight across. I'm going to take Black RTV and just put it in there as just kind of like something to keep it kind of stable. I mean, it's fine the way it is. It's just added a little security for me. But this is for anybody who decides to put the trail armor skid plate and the mud busters extended flares on your 1000 R-Max. All right. Bye.